So in this one, I want to go over something that's happening in the, well, Legends community, right? Obviously, Dragon Ball Legends, that's what I upload, that's what I play, that's what we all play. And it's this. Now, if you don't know what this is, I'm glad because you can't do this bullshit and gimmick the entire franchise and, well, the game in general and get your account banned. But that's for later. So Naz Darashi tweeted this, I feel like it's time to mention the fact that Spanish Legends community, I believe specifically Mexico, has discovered an enormous loophole with the mobile payment system OXO and are able to get unlimited free CC in Dragon Ball Legends with no bans made so far. I don't know, this needs attention. So he tweeted this image and basically it has no real context on it, but you don't know, well, there's context, but you don't know what it's necessarily about, right? He says these things, but there's no proof. Then you scroll down a little bit, keep it secret, let people enjoy themselves without dropping two grand, and then obviously he says no, which I agree with, because it completely ruins the atmosphere, the entire rest of the world, fuck that. It's not salt, it's not about, it's about not destroying the game. I agree. Um, if you are gimmicking the game and not giving them their money when you are, well, purchasing something and you are gimmicking that resource of getting the money, all that, you're screwing over the game, the franchise, the company, and inevitably making the game shut down that you are cheating over. <laughs> it's ironic. Now, for more proof and context, Tr Truth uh, quote tweeted this, if you do this, you'll be banned, Legends doesn't fuck around, don't do it. And then someone tweeted, apparently there's a glitch in Dragon Legends that lets you get a limited CC by using some weird payment method without getting anything sub subtracted. I can't speak. Getting anything subtracted from your account. Not going to detail with this though. And then you can see um, people purchasing and canceling because obviously you see the word cancel even if you don't know Spanish. Cancel is cancel. Canceling the purchases. And you might say, oh, but they're not getting the crystals, right? We, no, they are. Look, um, there. you see it right here. I'm not going to go into the whole video because the audio and all that. You see the he did the purchase. He quit the app. And it's going to say right here that it restores his purchase. And, well, he didn't actually purchase it. He just went into the screen that allows you to purchase. By the end of this little Twitter video, you will see a pop-up saying, um, your purchase CC has been restored. It was a glitch. And if you ever bought CC a good handful at a time, this will happen where your CC won't go through. Or if your bank takes too long, then it will <laughs> eventually... Uh, go through with the purchase if you quit the app, reset the app, something. But as you just saw, this guy just went through with the purchase, didn't get charged. Do you see it again? He's not getting charged. He's just getting on the screen and he's not getting charged. That's it. Um, it's idiotic. Don't do it. And for hindsight, every anniversary there's a band wave. And you know what? I'm glad these idiots that do these things... Um, they do it every time your anniversary, vendors, first anniversary, second anniversary, uh, more DCers because it was double RP season or triple RP season or golden showdown. People wanted their crystals for anniversary. And now it's this. It's every year there's something new and bullshit that these cheaters and honestly desperate people do. Now, if you're like, but I want to do this, you're going to get banned. Um, even if we go over this from last year, you go over the band wave. In measures to be taken against dishonest players, basically, hey, you got banned, buying, selling, giving, borrowing, or lending accounts, okay? Not part of this, so you're good, right? This isn't that. Buying, selling, trading, in-game items through unofficial means, that means the same exact thing, you can't really sell and trade items, but regardless. And then, requesting reimbursement or refunds for inapplicable reasons. I, I, I can't speak, I don't know why. What that means is if you buy something and you don't get charged, you're getting banned. You are. In particular, purchasing in-game items through unofficial means by unlawful means of payment may be deemed to be a criminal act. I mean, if you want to be a criminal, go ahead and do this. We kindly ask that you use official means of making purchases only. Now, okay, I might be wrong in my explanation in this, but let me explain to you. I think how this works just based off kind of logic and 
I used to spend money on gotchas when I was like 14. So obviously I didn't have a debit, credit, whatever card. I would get maybe like a gift card or something, right? So my logic, because I actually done this for a particular company. It just, it wasn't like, you know, massive amounts. I did it for a subscription service, basically like a Spotify type of thing or a Netflix type of thing or a Hulu, right? You would, this is how I did it. Now, I think it's been patched out to the maximum from when I did it back in the day, which was years ago, I'd say seven or eight years ago. You would link a prepaid card and, you know, maybe the first month, it only, it has $10 on it, let's say. So the first two months you get charged and then following months, it charges that prepaid card and you have no money on it. Now, I don't know like the safety procedures where it's like, okay, after the third month, it just auto charges you and then it's like, okay, it'll rack up the prepaid and then it'll be negative, but it's a prepaid card. It's not linked to a person. So it's not like it affects you primarily. That's how I feel this is being done through that uh, application. I believe it's OXO. I haven't looked into this. I've just been seeing this everywhere. Don't do it. Um, it's going to get you banned. I'm explaining it because maybe people are using prepaid cards. People are kids, right? Kids play this game. People that are below 18, 14, 16, whatever. You are playing this game if you are a child. That's just how it is. It's Dragon Ball. You like Dragon Ball. There's no, like, thing that's like, you must be this age. They don't really care. It's just something they have to put in to meet, like, a quota or standard. So you might be using a prepaid card and then accidentally doing this. Again, I don't know for sure if that is the case. Truly, I'm glad I don't know because then I can't inform you guys on how to do this bullshit. But from what I think, that is how they are doing it. It is just another system to get a... Uh, an account linked, I guess. Again, I don't really understand it. It doesn't really matter. But the point of this video is do not do this. You will get banned during anniversary. Funny enough, <laughs> they're kind of dickheads, Toshi and them. But I mean, it's smart. Um, Company-wise, financially, they ban after at anniversary banners drop. So it's like you could cheat the system, get all your crystals, you know, whatever, whatever. Good for you. But then two weeks later, they dropped the band wave, right? Because that was on the 10th of, what is that? June. <laughs> and anniversary was the 30th of May. So two weeks later, it's like, pop, you're banned. So if you want to be banned two weeks later after this anniversary, go ahead, man. You already made your decision. You got it. But for the 99% of players that just want to be in the loop and want to understand what's going on because they see this around. Obviously, big people are tweeting about it, talking about it. Don't do it. Um, just understand what it is. And if you're in a similar boat to where you're using a system equivalent to this, just make sure your balance is positive, not negative. Kind of simple. Like, you're taught that since, like, kindergarten. Just don't be down, be up <laughs> in any regard. So, yeah. And side note, for those wondering, I did delete the video yesterday. I felt like it was too, I don't know the word. It just felt too uh, ASCII. I don't like when I feel like I'm asking people to do this or help with this. I don't like doing that, but I appreciate the feedback I did get before I deleted it. Um, I just don't like how it came off personally. I might do another one um, similar to it, just more formal i feel like that was more bullshit honestly that was kind of it felt like a bullshit video and i didn't like having up my channel so if you're wondering why it's deleted it just didn't feel like something i'm proud of putting up now this one definitely not proud to showcase this but i'm proud to at least help you guys understand what's going on and yep yeah, if you guys are i mean if you know anyone that's doing this uh try to tell me it, uh comment it uh, then we can like DM and I could go into this further to explain it, not to, you know, help people do it, but just to explain like the situation and what the services particularly do so people aren't like blind to it. Cause right now it's just kind of like, huh? Like you understand it's a thing, right? You understand that it's happening, but you don't understand what in particular is actually going on in this scenario. You just know free crystals, free crystals, free crystals, which... It's never a good thing. <laughs> Honestly, people complain about free crystals. If you get free crystals in this game, that's most likely going to be a ban. Because they make it a limited amount of crystals. 
so people have to buy. That's the point of a gotcha. They give them enough to satisfy, or maybe not to satisfy in Legend's case, and then they're like, okay, if you save, you don't have to spend. But if you don't spend, then you must save. That's how gotchas work, in case you didn't know. But yeah, let me know what you guys think of this. I think it's complete bullshit. Uh, I'm glad the people that are doing it, because you know what? You'll get banned, and I'm happy to see you get banned if you're doing something dumb shit like this. But yeah, let me know what you guys think, and I'll see you guys in the next one.